Hey, Jeff. Hey, Spencer. Uh, it's me, Dan, from Harmontown. And I know, because you're sitting right next to me in a audio booth. Yeah, yeah. and we're, we're perched right here before a Harmontown episode, but mm-hmm. I wanted to remind you guys that I was recently on a, a Dumb People Town episode with the Sklar Brothers. Oh, yeah. They're, they're on NPR, right? I listened to uh, their, their show, Dumb People Town, because it came to feral audio. They're, they're pretty good for neurotypicals. What, 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 what was the news item that you talked about? Uh, we, did, they, we did three. There was like a naked lady in a, the, the, that came into someone's apartment, and there was was a person that uh, something about a magical car and uh, I can't remember that far. I one of my favorite stories. I listen to the podcast because it's on feral audio. One of my favorite stories is that a guy was naked and he pooped in someone's pool and he went into their house and fell asleep on a kid's bed. So and and the family didn't turn him in. They they right. they took him in as one of their own. <laughs> yeah, for better or for worse, these are the people that run the country now, and it's important to yeah, keep, learn about them. Yeah, like, yeah. We live in a world of dumb people. Uh, there's a podcast that makes it a little town, dumb people town. Yeah. Uh, uh, be the first at your next liberal party to understand your constituency, <laughs> or be be the third at your conservative party to to. Uh, reminisce about stupid things. Yeah, perhaps you're a Republican and you would like to know how to exploit these people for their labor. Um, well, you know, you learn learn what they're into, which, as it turns out, is uh, breaking windows and shitting in beds. Or just gently go to sleep to the dulcet tones of two scholars. <laughs> and one Dan Van Kirk. And one special guest. And sometimes their rich, famous friends call in. It's dumb people town on feral Adi. Oh. Oh. oh.